From the museum to the racetrack, Hall of Fame race car owner and Winston-Salem native Richard Childress gave his former driver, Kevin Harvick, a special send-off before Sunday's NASCAR Cup Series race at Atlanta Motor Speedway. Back in 2001, Harvick drove this exact number 29 white GM Goodwrench Chevrolet to his first career Cup Series victory in Atlanta. This came only three weeks after Dale Earnhardt Sr.'s death thrust Harvick into this ride. This car has been on display in the Richard Childress Racing Museum in welcome ever since, but was brought back to the Speedway to run parade laps alongside Harvick before his final race here. Childress even gave the command to fire engines while sitting in this car. Harvick and others were eager to see this piece of NASCAR history up close again. I can't believe that he actually pulled the car out of the museum and, and put his putting it on the racetrack, but it's a big deal to both of us. And, and you know, I think for, for both of us to be able to, to celebrate that together at the same racetrack and, and um, you know, for me personally to see his enthusiasm about it means a lot. My dad said he's more nervous about the 29 car going around the track this weekend than our cup car. So he wants to make sure that that car makes his laps and then uh, he'll be relaxed for the rest of the race because it's uh, our whole shop has dug in on that car and, and put a lot of work to get it running. A team member said this undertaking was an all hands on deck effort keeping this living piece of NASCAR history 100% original. Reporting in the triad, Zach Tucker, ABC 45 News, standing up for you.